YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I am your host, The Traveling Beer. We are back with another video today. It is a comment um, that I have to answer. Um, this was given to me by um, a sterile processing page. Um, I'll put it on the screen here so we all can go through it. Uh, relatively, I like to go over things like this so we could just all be helpful. And I'm going to help you today. So let me read it. Out of curiosity and fun, I'm interested to see what kind of places everyone is using during their travel journeys. And they listed a few. So one was furnished room in house. One is a rent apartment. Another one is Airbnb slash Verbo. Another one is ex hotel slash extended stay. Now I would say this. Uh, in the beginning, God created. Let me stop. In the beginning, um, I would say. A lot of people, when we first started traveling, hotels were the popular thing to use because hotels were uh, were very affordable in the beginning. It was very affordable, and so was Airbnb. So Airbnb, um, Airbnb, as well as apartments, and also Craigslist were the main three sites that most travelers use about five, even more years ago. We those were the sites, Craigslist. Airbnb and hotels were the three main things. Now we have Airbnb and uh, Furnish Finders, who are you know primarily the top users of travelers. I would say Furnish, uh, Furnish Finders, uh, Furnish yeah Furnish Finders are, is the top, mainly because they generally stick with travelers. Travelers now with Furnish Finders, you have to have some type of information for the for the host to know that you are actually a traveler because they could just they don't want to take on anybody so they'll probably ask you for your contract they'll probably ask you for your agency they probably want to know the end the, your completion date and your beginning date so you know those are things that you may need to give to them but within this list that they give uh, I would tell you to scratch everything from this list. And this is what you would this is what you should do as a new traveler or a current traveler. This is something that most people do not talk about. So what you would want to do is when you are going to a different state, go to a different for example, let's say I am going to Virginia. Right? What I'm gonna do is search in property management. Property management in Virginia in that said state city that you are going to. Right within that said state, state that you're actually in, you want to talk to the property managers and ask them, "Hey, I'm a traveling nurse. I'm a traveling healthcare profession. Um, do you have any housing that is affordable for me to stay at?" And they will have housing for you to stay at. Now it may. Now the only catch with it is going to may come unfurnished. So be prepared to have unfurnished housing. But if they can furnish it, take the furnished. Only thing you may have to pay is just the utilities, which is the water and the heat, which would you will still be coming off a lot cheaper month by month than paying a high premium at an Airbnb for a room for fourteen hundred for just a room, not, not, not the whole house, but just a room. Now you think of it like this: if you are able to get that housing for said time for about three months and you are telling other travelers that you have this house, you guys can actually all split it and sublease it to each other. So that way the bill is not all on one person, but it's split a couple of different ways. Now those are some, now that is one thing I just wanted to give you guys, like just have you guys out there aware that's something you can do. All right, I just wanna make this video short and sweet. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, share the video. Hopefully this was informative. Don't forget guys, you're gonna to go to apartments, I mean, you're going to go to pro property management within that said state you are going to. Within that said state, you should be able to find something affordable. If not, you got furnished finders, okay? Furnished finders is always it's the, the top two. All right, guys, I'm out. Peace.